Once more. You know, we really ought to pay attention to the title of this series because it quite clearly says not to die on it. And uh, we ain't doing very well at that. I'm not even entirely sure where that last arrow came from. And, ooh, spruce. I don't think we've had this yet. In this series, anyways. Have we had a spruce spawn yet? I don't think so. I don't even know if we're going to be able to mine this. Oh, yeah, we are. Without, like, building up. But I guess we did. Are there any other shorter ones? Yeah, this one. That way we can get them without making ladders or anything. The time has come for us to actually survive in a hardcore series. Thing is, we kind of need food before we sprint off into the ether. And uh, I don't have any of that right now. So we're going to need to get some. Even though we have, like, a quarter of a stack of wood on us. Ooh, we got berries. There's food. There's even a cave, but I don't think we're going to go down there immediately yet. We haven't had... Well, we have had luck with that in the past, but... Not very recently. <laughs> Is half a stack of food already? Just gonna have to be careful to make sure we don't accidentally go through all of it too fast. all of this real quick. This is levitating in the air, isn't it? Eh, kind of. It was up against this. Is this a... Oh, no, this is a tiny one. I guess we survive off of berries for the time being. Okay, we're going towards positive Z, apparently. Let's see how this goes, especially if we can get these. And we're on the x-axis of one. Ooh, we got a ton of these. Yay. Free food. On the road again. Immediately come across a massive valley that's like impenetrable to cross. Okay. I guess we go this way. Yeah, we can... If I jump down over here somehow without magically dying... Whoa. Then hopefully we can get to shore over here where the land's lower. Ooh, we got one of these already. I like these flowers. Whoop. Let me try now. We got some of these real quick. I think we'll be able to get up over here. And make a run for it.
as we're already 120 blocks off course, just because there is a mountain there. There's still a mountain there. That's quite annoying. Okay, we're just gonna... There we go. Problem solved. Try and get somewhat back on course over here so that we're not going in circles. A bit of a wildflower biome. So far, I'm just seeing a lot of, honestly, what you'd typically see. The pig, some birch forest. But where's the exciting stuff? We're here for some adventure. And adventure we shall have. One day we'll survive a full hundred days in hardcore mode, maybe. I gotta tell you, that creeper really surprised me. It surprised me so much I switched to third person instead of, like, shielding. Oh, yay, flowers. There we are. Now we're on track. Perfectly so. Whoa. That's quite the hole. One that I doubt we're equipped to deal with. Come on. Now, I know we had that one world that was, like, 99% jungle for some reason, but... Did I not pick that up? I did not. Oh, there's two sheep here. This might warrant the creation of my first tool. A, di er, a diamond. A wooden axe. What are you guys doing? I'd love to shear you, but honestly, I don't have any iron right now, so that's not going to happen. Thank you. I don't see any other sheep anywhere, so we're just going to have to hope we find another one. Although I will eat the mutton right now so that I don't... Waste my other food, as berries can actually be planted. I might as well take these. See some more of those other flowers up there, but I'm not going that far out of my way just to get flowers. Well, hi there. What are you doing? Just a little puppy. Might as well get a bunch of these. You know what I say, we got a spot in our inventory devoted to them. We might as well get a full stack of them. I need one more wool to be able to make a bed. You know what I should have that like that. Then 
another couple. And a plains biome. And is that a desert biome? It might be, or it might just be beaches. I can't tell. Well, anyways, plains biome could mean village, which could mean, you know, adequate ooh. You know what it does mean? Sheep. We're not quite in the zone where we're going to be in danger from us not sleeping, but... I might as well just make one anyways. Why is it defaulting to that? There we go. Day two already. 98 more to go. Still need to veer more this way again. Do I? No, I do not. Okay. I don't have random excess wool in my inventory. I'm not seeing any sort of villagers or anything, so we're not going to stop here. If we could find some hay bales, that'd be probably the most expeditious form of getting food. Ow, what was that? How am I taking damage? Well, there's some pumpkins. We can grab those, if for nothing else, for seeds. The time is nigh to harvest the pumpkins. <laughs> And to eat more berries. Oh, shit. I keep forgetting you have to, like, look at the sky when you eat these. Because if you plant them and you don't, like, wait for them to plant produce berries, you don't get anything back from them. <laughs> Guess I can keep killing sheep. Should probably start killing cows, honestly. No. No. There we go, free food. There's so many of you. Not that I'm complaining. Bring out all the free stuff. Oh no, it broke. I guess we have to pounce you. Is there like a hole over here I can go to to get some stone. It looks like there might be. Yes, perfect. Slap that down. Make. There we go. We'll just make sticks until we and fit those on there. Perfect. And then we just do that. Ooh, iron. That's nifty. One of those. I guess we put everything up and then reorganize that food, other food. Get a bunch of all of this stuff. I definitely... That's one of the best or quickest ways we found iron. We started... I wasn't even looking for it. It is only three, but that's enough for a pickaxe. Make our 
ourselves an axe real quick. Actually, we'll make two of each just so that we have backups. And we'll put these down there. Pick this up. More of that. Ooh, we can even make a boat. Boom. Off we go. Probably want to get some kelp here in a second. Preferably when we're not in 10 million feet of water surrounded by drowns. But there's some easy stuff. Just pop off right here and grab this. Oh, yay. Well, there's some down here, but they don't have anything, so fine. Time to vamoose before those guys realize we're here. Pick up some more along the way. I'm not seeing anything too exciting right off the bat underwater. I mean, that could be a drowned thing over there, but those never have anything super useful in them. Bunch of kelp that way. How long will we be journeying for this time? There's like a cave or something. There's a bunch of fish. We don't really need any more kelp, and we don't really need any fish. We need a biome like no other. Basically, we need either a cherry blossom or a mangrove. If they're in close proximity to each other, then even better. Oh. Mm. There we go. All I'm seeing is ocean. How big is this? I mean, I get it's the ocean, but it is going to make it very easy for us to travel a very long ways, but uh, I think we had something else in mind. That could be a shipwreck over there, but I definitely don't want to risk going for one in this deep of water when we have no armor and stone tools. That is not advantageous. What's this over here? Just a big blank spot where there's no kelp or anything? That's kind of weird. There's something over there. Here we have a little tiny... Was this plains biome? It's got to be a plains biome. Savannah over there. That's interesting. We do got to veer this way anyways to try and stay on course. Because we're trying to stay on the x-axis of 1 while we increase the z-axis. But we keep veering too far off to the side to avoid stuff. Yeah, we're already 3,000 blocks from spawn. That's nothing to shake at, to scoff at, whatever. Ooh, warm ocean biome. Those aren't that common. I mean, it's not the rarest thing in the world, but they're not horrifically common. 
Should we stop and get some of these trees? I think we shall. We'll have spruce trees. We'll have acacia trees. We'll have all the trees. Except for the two basic kinds that we just completely walked past and never got any of. Watch, we're going to settle in like some biome that has no birch or oak trees anywhere near it. Hello, turtles. Am I not turtly enough for the turtle club? Okay, you could just drop a couple saplings. That'd be perfect. Now, wouldn't it? Might have to sleep again here. Push it over to night or day three. There we go, there's one. Now we would like more than one, but I think I'm going to have to sleep soon. Grab this. Slap that down. Maybe I'll mine one more. See if it gets any more stuff. I think if I mine more than one, it's gonna, like, pull over into nighttime and we're gonna have stuff spawning. And that's going to be not of the good. Sleep real quick, push it into day three. Okay, grab that real quick. Any more saplings? None there, none over there. Well, there's one. Whoop. Did you drop anything? A stick? Yay. Dude, what are you doing? That was one cat stepping on that table. <laughs> and honestly, I'm not even sure which one that was because I have all the lights off. George, was that you? I'm blaming George. Okay. Off we go. There's a ton of warm ocean over here. Wow. Honestly, I've never built much with coral, so I'm not sure what I'd really do with it. There's a shipwreck over there. That's in way too deep at water. That's like shaped like the Aladdin genie lamp. I was very much not expecting an ocean of this magnitude. <laughs> we had jungle planet, and now we have ocean planet. What is that? Planes? It's gotta be planes. There's nothing on it. So much kelp. Ooh, jungle! I don't know what that was, but... Let's see if we can get some uh, cocoa beans from this, and then we'll move on. I ain't got a whole lot of time left in this episode. Ooh, we can get bamboo, too. Oh, and melons? You're making landfall right over here. Definitely not going to chop down one of the big ones, but get a couple of the little ones that have the cocoa beans on them, and... We'll be set. Come on. There we go. Ooh, three sheep, too. Nice of you to give us such a warm welcome. Get it? Because they give you wool, which is warm. Oh, there's a panda. What more could you want? Uh, 
I say fully acknowledging that we're, like, abandoning this biome forever to find something better. Fifty-two. I don't see any melons, and I'm also not seeing any cocoa beans right off the bat. Is that a... We need, like, smaller trees, because they will have the cocoa beans on them, and, ooh, melons. And they'll also give us more saplings without us having to use 17 axes to cut down a tree over here. There's a cave. Some water. A mountain covered in sparse jungle. Actually, this might be... Yep, this is exactly what we're looking for. That's a nice place right there. Let's just boop on over here and get these, and then I'll probably end the video, because we're at 26 minutes. And we have if we hit 30, then I have to delete part of the video before I put it in my hard drive because it won't fit. Most computers won't move a file that's over 4 gigabytes, so... Also, it starts taking a ludicrous amount of time to start, uh... What's the word? Getting it uploaded if you go over 4 gigs, which is around half an hour of video. Maybe we can even get some saplings out of this. That'll be great. This one's got it. That one went on a thingy. Well, this one's out. Move the new one down. Do we have any? Not yet. Okay, so there's one. Some more cocoa beans that we missed somehow. Eat this. Eat some of these. Not seeing a ton of other saplings. Huh. Just a little too tall. Any more? We need like three more. Another stick. Ooh, there's one, two. I think that one was an oak sapling, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh, there we go. There's the fourth one. Okay. That should be good, and I think we'll end the series. The end of the series. We'll end the episode right here. I'll see you guys in the next one. Until then, have fun, guys.